Hey guys, it's Juan coming at you with a brand new video. This one would not be a walkthrough, it's actually going to be our first tutorial. What I'm going to show you guys is how to actually poke agent. Now, for those of you who don't know, it's pretty much the fastest possible way to get a Pokemon that you need without having to go through the breeding process to get perfect IVs, perfect EVs, nature, and abilities, and so on. Now, some people call this cheating, other people just call it a, pretty much a detour. Something like you just do really quick to get it and have to go through hours and hours of breeding. Anyways, this is for a Mac, since I own a Mac. I'll put the links down below how to download this. So once you download it, just follow what I'm about to show you. Alright, so first things first, once you download the thing, you open it. And you want to know which Pokemon you want. So, start typing. I'm going to show you guys how to get a Charizard. So you get Charizard, okay? You hit this F. It's pretty much to find you the number, the code that goes to that Pokemon. Now you want obviously perfect IVs, so you're going to put 32 on 31 on everything, sorry. 31, 31, 31, 31, 31. Now if you want uh, a special hidden power, you just hit hidden power. You pick the one that you want. Since I don't, you don't have to, okay? Now the nature I want for him, I want it to be, uh, let's say timid, male, doesn't matter, ability, it's going to be solar power, that's the one I want, okay? Now you hit okay, you hit search first, it's going to show up one, two, even three, you get to pick whichever you want. As you can see by clicking this one, my speed EVs has to be 30, now that's because of hidden power, I believe, so don't I mean, it's not going to have perfect IVs, but it's going to be near perfect, which is almost impossible to find on just without doing this. Once you're done, you hit OK. So, yeah. Next thing you want to do is right click right here, and hit set. Make sure you see the icon of the Pokemon here. If not, uh, it won't show up in your box. So next, you can type in a nickname, I will, uh, after talking about my boy Vaughn, who's going to show you the rest the, the final part of the video. We came up with the real OG, because it's the, the real original gangster. Let's be honest, yes. So we're going to click here um, to make sure the nickname shows up. You want him, obviously, level 100. I want him to be uh, timid. I want him to be, to have a choice, scarf. And I want his ability to be solar power. Okay. Now the country, obviously I'm in the U.S., so I will pick U.S., you can pick other countries that it's compatible with, and the origin, I'm going to pick white, because that's the game I'm playing. Now you go to Met, this is where you met him. Now, uh, it really doesn't matter, you can put whatever you want, location, I'm just going to put, uh, I don't know, okay, transfer, which I think is the easiest one to pick, well, whatever, this, this is really just basic information that you can put if you want, you don't have to, I'm just going to skip it over, it's up to you guys. So, uh, I'm going to want him to have as fast as possible since he's timid, so I'm going to give him 252, there's a maximum of 510, uh, so therefore you know, I want him to be, eh, say 200, I'm going to fill his special attack and the rest is going to his defense. Now, I only go up to 508 because the number of EVs you have to put has to be divisible by 4 and 508 is, 510 is not. The last two EVs will be a, a complete waste so therefore I don't even put them. You want to put them? Knock yourself out. It's really not a big deal. The attacks you want to have. So I want to uh, have Air Slash. Uh, you can put PP up so he has maximum PPs. Fire. Blast. Focus. Blast. And Dragon Pulse, for example. Okay. Now maximum PP, so they have maximum amount. It will not run out. Last but not least is this one most important part. This is how you get it to your own uh, game. Now you're gonna have to type in your Pokemon uh, Trainer's ID, which you find in your in your Pokemon Trainer uh, in the menu. Once you're in the game, just hit Start. You go to your character's name, and the ID should be there. 
and you type in your uh, trainer name. For example, I'm just gonna put a random number, one, two, three, four, five. Name is um just gonna put Pokemon, okay? Once you're done, you hit generate shiny ID. So if you want it to be shiny, if not, you can just get rid of it. Okay, and once you're done with this, you go to File, Save Pokemon from Tab, and then you pick the as this guy. Save. Yes, all of this. Once you're done with this, I'm gonna show you where to go from here. All right, guys. Now welcome back. I'm gonna show you the uh, second part of what I showed you before. Once you got your Pokemon ready, this is what you do. Go to your game, and you go start it. Okay, now you go down to Nintendo connection settings. Okay, now you get Nintendo Wi-Fi. You go to whatever connection you're using. This is just a setup, so I don't have, that's actually not my information, but just to show you. You're going to go down to where it says auto-obtain DNS. You're going to hit no. And then you're going to type in that DNS that I showed that you see on your left side. So it's going to be 204-45-2954. Okay, once you're done, hit OK. Yes, they're correct. And it's just after you're done, just save settings. Alright, so now you go back and then you start your game. And from here, my boy Van will take it over and show you how to uh, collect the Pokemon we just created. Take it over, Van. What's good, people? I go by the name Vaughn. I'm one half of the YouTube channel, Juan and Vaughn. I'm here to show you the tutorial on how you pick up a Pokemon that you made through Pokegen at the Global Trade Station. So, yeah, this is the first time you're actually hearing my voice. That's because Juan's been doing all the work, and I haven't been able to do any of it because my computer's a piece of shit, and I need to throw it out ASAP and cop me a Mac. But, I don't have the money for that. So... Right now I can't do any LPs, even though I have one really cool one in mind. But in the meantime, I could bring you competitive Pokemon Battle, which I plan on doing that within the next week. But without further ado, let me show you how you pick up this bitch. Anyway, you go up the stairs, right up here, and then you talk to her. The one all the way on the right, and just remember you go there with a full party. Do not go there with anything shorter than a full party, because if you do, you are going to be really mad by picking up a Pokemon with zero HP. And I'm sure you don't want that, especially with the Blissey, because those things have a shitload of HP. Alright, so, click on Global Trade, then the rest, just spam A, even if it says your mother's a slut, it doesn't matter, I don't care. Yes, I would like to save the game. And you are now welcomed in. <clears throat> now, for some reason, actually, if you want to connect Pokemon Wi-Fi, which should be an obvious... Yes, which is stupid. Man, you guys must be here because you guys are tired of fucking EV training like I was and want to find out an alternative way to get your Pokemon. You know, like people like Shofu and Hayden, Black Blastoise, all of them. This is how they get them. Or Pokestop, either one. But I like using this because it's, in my personal opinion, the easiest way to get a Pokemon. And here he is. That dude! The real OG! Yeah, 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 There we go. Uh, just press, oh, B, and then A. To get the fuck out of there. <coughs> yeah, disconnecting, whatever. Alright, so now, since I, what's it called? Yeah, since I don't have room in my party once on my PC, because I'm not retarded, go to move Pokemon, I'm sure you know how to get to move Pokemon. Oh, it is, actually, that's the one right there. 
I'm going to just show you what, what, what. We want a little summary. Choice car, flow 100. Probably mad at two at the battle subway. You know. There's its stats. Pretty much this is something I've used in the Sun Team. Dragon Pulse and Fire Blast gives you perfect coverage, except for Heat Ran, and that's why you have Focus Blast. And then you have Air Slash to stab to deal with like fighting. But yeah, so 329 gives with Timid Nature gives him max speed, along with Choice Scarf, which will make him an amazing, amazing revenge killer. So that's about all the time I have for you today. That's how you get the Pokemon. Please tell your friends about this. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.